In this video, we're going to be reviewing coconut curry wraps. Hi there, John here, and welcome to my low carb life. Now, that's the channel where I bring you low carb reviews, information, and tips to help you lead your best low carb life. So if you like to sign up, make sure to hit the subscribe button and don't forget to turn notifications on so you never miss another upload from me. So I've been in low carb since 2015 and in all that time I've been looking for a decent low carb wrap that's going to sort of fill the holes being left by not being able to eat normal tortillas on this way of living. And so I've tried to make some of my own in the past and to be honest they've all ended up being a disaster when I've got recipes from various places online. So when I saw these coconut wraps on Amazon I thought I'd give them a try. The only flavour available when I got them was these which are the curry flavour pure wrap coconut ones. You can get the plain flavours, I believe, but they weren't available when I bought them. So let's have a look at the macros and the ingredients on the back of the packet before we give them a try. So on the back here we've got macros per wrap. The fat content is 2.5 grams. Total carbs is 8. And if you take off one for the fibre, it's 7 grams net, I believe. And the protein values here are 0. And ingredient-wise, we've got coconut meat, coconut water, organic curry powder and Himalayan salt. So those ingredients are looking pretty good and the macros look good too. But what do they taste like? Well, I've got some chicken in the oven at the moment, so I'm going to serve that up, put them in a wrap and we'll see what we think. So this is what they look like. They are square, they feel a bit waxy and they've got a very strong smell of curry, which I suppose you'd expect as their curry flavour. They're quite flexible, they, um, as you can see it rolls up pretty well like that, so I'm going to be able to fit the chicken and whatever in there when I have it. So yeah, that's initial thoughts are, yeah, they look quite good apart from the waxy texture is a bit strange, but I've seen this before in other local wraps I've tried in the past. So yeah, the next thing to do is to get the chicken cooked. Right, so the chicken's cooked. So let's roll it up and we'll see how, what it tastes like. I showed you earlier, it does roll up quite well. And there it is all in there. The chicken and the lettuce and the fillings in there. So anyway, let's see what it tastes like. The yeah, taste of curry flavour, very strong. It's almost overpowering to be honest. And then there's also a bit of waxy, the waxy texture, which I told you about, you can feel. You can feel the wax, wax coming off on the fingers there. The waxy texture, you can taste it as well. It's okay, but it's uh, <laughs> it's probably not the best wrap you're going to try. So that's another um, bite which Give a second opinion. Yeah, it does the job. It is okay, but the waxy factor and the overriding curry thing. I mean, without the curry flavour, I wonder if it just tastes of coconut. I don't know if, if you have the original coconut flavour. These wraps are four perhaps you could let me know in the comments below. Okay, so I've finished that wrap now. So let's go to the positives and negatives so I can tell you whether I think you should give it a try or not. So positive number one, is that it's low in carbs, coming in at seven grams net carbs per serving per wrap. That's pretty good in anyone's book. So if you're on a keto low carb diet, I think it could be worth a try for that. And positive number two is they don't fall to pieces when you roll them up. Um, they hold together pretty well. And positive number three is convenience, being able to buy it online and know it's got low carbs. And also the fact that you're not gonna have to spend hours in the kitchen trying to make your own version that most of the time goes wrong to be honest, as in my experience anyway. On the negative side however, I've got to say that I think my main negative is the waxy texture. They are waxy in feel like I showed you and they have wax on the fingers. I think maybe the coconut meat factor and also they taste a bit waxy. And my second negative is the overriding flavour of curry. Now the cynical side of me says oh, they put the curry flavour in there to mask the coconut flavour. So I'm going to recommend this product or not. Well, also I'm going to say give it a try. It's got good macros, the carb content's pretty low, it's convenient, and also doesn't fall to pieces when you wrap it up. On the negative side though, like I said a minute ago, it's waxy, and the curry flavour's a bit overriding. But for convenience factor, yeah, I'd say give it a try, you might like it. It's going for about £10.99 on Amazon here in the UK at the moment. The current packs of eight, not available in America right now, but I think there are other versions you can get. You can definitely get the original coconut flavour in America. So that's my view of the coconut flavour coconut wraps. Do you agree with my view? 
Do you disagree? Will you be trying them? Have you tried them already? And have you tried the original flavour? Leave me a comment below and we can have a discussion about it. And also, if you're on Instagram, go and check me out over there because I've got an account called John's Low Carb Life and I do product reviews over there on IGTV sometimes. So it's definitely worth a follow there to get some more product reviews from me. So anyway, if you like this video, give it a like, consider subscribing to more content coming up soon, and why not share with your friends. And also, if you another video from me right now, click or tap the video on the screen here. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, click or tap the picture of my face that's on the screen right now. That's it for now. So until next time, go out there and lead your best low-carb life, and I'll see you on the next video. Okay, bye now.